I've taken the seat out of the truck. I'm hoping the camera will show it. But it's all very damp along this rear edge. What I initially set out to do was to try and um, stop the seat from rattling. Where the seat back goes against here it rattles. But the seat back isn't fixed into the um, base part of the seat. It should be screwed together but I can't imagine how you can manhandle the seat in and out with it fixed together. But that's how it's supposed to be. So I'm going to try that I suppose. Um, but first thing I'm going to do is vacuum out some of this rubbish. Get something to sort of scrape it out with. This will do. Chisel. My poor, my poor old woodworking tools. Well, that's better along there. I thought that was quite a deep groove there, but it's not, it's only shallow. It's lucky, I'm lucky that it hasn't all rusted out. That's the problem though, isn't it? This seal is completely trashed. Probably can't see it because the light's blowing it out. But you can see the seal is completely you know, non-existent really. Okay, patina is okay, but patina, whatever it is, is okay. But this patina of this seal is going to cause me rust problems, and that's not that's not the idea, is it? Now, surprisingly, I mean, there's bright, shiny bare metal where that sound deadening. I've just scraped it off. So, you know, that's surprising, isn't it? 1941 truck in an area where you'd expect it to have all rusted out. So I'm quite happy with that. I need to oh, somewhere. I've got a a uh, new rubber that might do that. I'll have to see if I can find that. The bottom of the seat back there is all rusty. Also the frame has broken in a few places. And it's got the remnants of mouse, well probably like a mouse nest or something like that. So basically it's not very nice. So that'll be the secondary part of the job will be to get this all looking a lot better. If I can fix that window from leaking, what I might do is take the cover off this seat and um, take the cover off and uh, repair the frame there and just do it a bit better. That might not ever happen but at least I'm aware of what I should be doing. Most important thing, have a cup of tea. I've just took these screws out from there. A couple of them were tight, so I'm going to run a tap down through the holes. There we go, one. Oops. I 
I could be lazy and put it in the electric drill, but you know what I mean? Sometimes you just gotta be a bit old school. It's only cleaning the threads, obviously, so it shouldn't be too difficult. Good taps and dies are one of the best things you can have. Good quality second hand ones are the best. Unless you can afford brand new, good quality ones. Good quality ones. Whoops. Now that insert's a little bit loose. So I've just gotta try not to dislodge it. I think they just kind of pull in from the other side. I was just amazed that the brackets were there and the screws were still there. I found two of them in the, you know, in, the, in that compartment under the seat. That luckily, whoever took them out left them in the holes, and two of them were still in, and two of them had fell out. Okay, good. What I might try and do is put a bit of bicycle inner tube over the um, the two bits that stick up. Now what I think I'll do is try and take some of that out of there. I think I'll put some gloves on. Bit of rusty metal there. Right, there's some repairs needed to the frame here, it's broken. I think I'll... Kind of rattle. Any loose stuff out? Yeah, that's good. That's some summit's come out. Let's see if I can wrestle this into the car now. Okay. Right. Okay. It's a bit strange. The. Oh, there we go. There's some kind of things here that have to align. I think that's it. Okay, that's in there. That's good, because that's not rattling there like it was. Oh, maybe it is a bit actually. to align it. I think that's it. Okay, that's better.
one. Does make it a lot more. Well, that's better, yeah. I can feel it supporting the lower parts of my back better now. But I'm puffed out. Okay, cool, man. Let's get rid of that one of the annoying rattles now. That's good. Still need to seal the window. Now before when I did that, it was like clunk 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 and it's supporting me better down here now. The seat back can be stripped down and repaired at a later date. The base of the seat can be improved. What I think I'll do is get some aluminium plates and put them over where those holes are so it locates a bit better but no, I think that's okay. Job well done. Only putting it back to how it should have been. Okay, right, that'll do for now. Cheers then. Let's see what I need to do. Stop the camera. There we go.